Have a great time. Be safe. Here we go. So how the Hood to Coast team came together, we needed 12 runners, and I had an email from a Gene Dykes. You know, I told him that uh, we're the meanest, nastiest seven-year-olds who want to make a statement. And then before too long, uh, Janine Rice, fastest woman marathon runner in the world. I called Amby up, I said, Amby, I got Gene Dykes and Janine Rice and Nolan Shahid on the team. He goes, oh, maybe I'll be interested now. And before I knew it, I was turning people down on the team. Back when I was running in the Marine Corps, there was a guy who beat me and he was an officer, a Marine Corps officer. I hated officers. This guy's name's Dennis Leaf. He ran every day of his life, except one day he would take off from running. And he'd get to the food bank. You guys, running like you are, are giving the world something that they have never seen before. The drivers are on a mission. They got to get to the next checkpoint, give it your best, make it a challenge. It's going to hurt, it's going to be painful. But remember, we get margaritas. <laughs> we'll call it an evening. Get some good sleep. Get some rest. seconds to your starts. Have a great time, be safe. Here we go, five, four, three, two, one, go to tea time! I started in junior high school and high school and I, I was really terrible at most sports. I couldn't play basketball or baseball or any of those, but I could run. Oh. <laughs> Felt good, a lot of downhill. I started to run when I was 35, which is almost 39 years ago, and I got hooked to run marathon. How many roadkill did you have? I passed 22 people. <laughs> My goal was, let's start with 10. Oh, it was a great run. Nobody passed me. I was in high school and college before Title IX, so running and track or anything for women was just not available to me. So I didn't know I was any good till I started running when I turned 30. The last part was the fastest 5K I've done in years. Well, I was about 32 years old. I didn't have sports for girls in high school. And, and then I was married, I had three kids. <laughs> you got here You got here way ahead of time. Oh um, yeah, lots of butterflies. <laughs> uh, I started when I was in junior high school. I was the first kid at school to run a sub six minute mile. Yes, yeah, Steve! Jeannie told me 50 minutes, so if I come in over 50 minutes, she's gonna give me hell. My earliest? Well, I actually started running when I was a young, young teenager before anybody else was running. In fact, I never even saw another runner. It just occurred to me to go out running one day. Did our runner come in yet? Yeah, he's coming right here. Yeah, he's around the back. 49.55. I started early on in junior high school on the track team. I was overall pleased, a lot of downhill. Dad was a uh, high school coach, and uh, I remember he 
When I was very young, he made me a set of starting blocks. I ran in high school. I was 14 years old. I did a couple years in high school cross country and indoor and outdoor track. Oh, yes. So I started running at an early age. I'd run down to the grocery store and back and I'd tell my mother, time me, time me. So she'd put the look at the clock and I'd go down and I'd go, mom, what was my time? And she'd go, God, I don't know, it was somewhere. No, you're supposed to get my time. So my next Christmas present was a stopwatch. Whew. Yeah, baby. Thanks, if you start walking with me, I'm telling you, we race to get here. Well, I started when I was in my 30s, overweight. Uh, friends came to run the New York City Marathon. I decided that they could do it, I could. And a year later, uh, after a lot of struggles, I ran the 1979 New York City Marathon. Another one came by and he said, he said, uh, uh, like, man, how long have you been doing this? I said, 44 years. He said, I want to thank you for inspiring all of us. To junior high, I, I ran a lot, running on the track team there, uh, doing sprints. Actually, the navigator. I'm supposed to keep track of people. We only have two runners left. All right. They were kicking it, so I had to do my thing. And my younger daughter was a, uh, you know, had also ran on the cross country team. And that's how, how I got into running. And so it took about six months, but I did join them. And so I always describe this as falling in with a bad crowd. You know, they all talked about running all the time. And when I was 58, I did my first races. But in New York, I qualified for Boston. So I had to do that. So here, from never having done a marathon, I did three marathons in five months. <laughs> well, uh, running is actually part of my life. I started to run when I was age 35, just to lose a couple pounds. I get up in the morning, I go out run, I just enjoy it. So it's like a people gamble. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a race junkie. All my friends used to, you know, call me genius a race junkie. If they say any race, I race. And my role in the team, um, I guess I coordinate part of it. Tacos are one of the best things that I can create. There will always be challenges. Every year, you know, the energy gets better. Tener la oportunidad de poner estas recetas mías con esta familia es algo increíble. This is one of the reasons I'm coming back because I love his food. Can't wait for next year. Yeah! Yeah!